Good evening, everyone. Please stand for the presentation and posting of the colors, the pledge to the American and Texas flag, and the invocation. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing to honor the Texas flag. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. Now Justin will lead us our invocation. Could everyone please bow their heads and join me for the invocation. Dear Creator, we come kneeling at your throne of grace once again, giving you all the thanks, for we know that we could not be here today without you. Once again, I ask for an aura of protection over my classmates, their families, and their friends, dear Heavenly Creator, and we ask that you continue to guide us down the road in which you want for us. We thank you for equipping our leaders with the knowledge and the necessities to bring us to this moment in our lives, dear, dear Creator. And we once again thank you. Amen. Okay, you may be seated. If you'll please take your seats, please take your seats. Your graduate has asked that you treat this exercise with the utmost respect. Every graduate deserves to hear his or her name announced. Please refrain from using any noisemakers, horns, bells, yells, or any other distractors that are not conducive to maintaining the dignity and grandeur of this event. We ask that you hold your applause and congratulatory yells until after all names have been called so that the next name called can be clearly heard. Your assistance will help provide the very best graduation for each and every student. And I also ask for you please to turn off your cell phones at this time. Thank you in advance for your cooperation to ensure a dignified graduation ceremony. Su gradado ha perdido que traga, que trata esta ejercicio con el mucho respeto. Cada graduado merece oír su nombre anunciado. Por favor, abstenerse de utilizar cualquiera de los elementos matracas bocinas, campañas, gritos, o cualquier otros distractores que no son propios para el mantenimiento de la dignidad y la grandeza de, esta, de este evento. Le pedimos que mantengan sus aplausos y gritos de felicitación hasta que después de todos los nombres han sido llamados para que el nombre de la próxima llamada puede ser escuchado claramente. Su cooperación ayudará a 
proporcionar la mejor de la graduación para cada estudiante. Y por favor, apagan sus teléfonos celulares. Gracias de, de, mango, de mando por su cooperación para asegurar una digna ceremonia. Welcome to the fifth graduation of Emmett J. Conrad High School. My name is Dr. Lucy Davila Hakamak, and I am the proud principal of this graduating class of 2013. A Conrad student comes from many places in the city and many places from around the world. Regardless of their origins, they become Conrad Chargers and enrich the lives of all of us who have taken on the privilege of teaching them. And it is a privilege to teach them. Graduation is a time of endings and new beginnings. And we are pleased that all of you are here to share our excitement about these students as they and their educational career at Dallas Independent School District and prepare to take the next steps in their lives. Benvenido a el quinto graduación de esta escuela secundaria de Emmett J. Conrad. Un estudiante de Conrad viene de muchas partes de la ciudad y de muchos lugares del mundo. A pesar de todos los orígenes, se convierten en Conrad Chargers y enrisquen las vidas de todos nosotros que consideramos la enseñanza de nuestros estudiantes como un privilegio. At this time, Violeta Traviso will introduce our honored guest. The names of schools evoke the character of the person for whom they are named. We here at MAJ Conrad are especially proud of our namesake Dr. Conrad, a noted physician and education advocate. Dr. Conrad worked on the Dallas Independent School District for a decade, promoting free lunch for poor students and the integration of administrative staff in schools. He worked to help shape the Texas school reforms, including pre-kindergarten and no play, no pass rule. He worked hard for all of us, and then he returned his practice in Dallas, where he never moved his office from where he began in the neighborhood where he started because he wanted his clients to have access to his service. His bride, Mrs. Conrad, worked and stood by his side through his career and home life. And as lo along with her children, she worked to honor his legacy in our community. Today, unfortunately, she is unable to join us in our celebration. Um, please join me in giving thanks for her, even though she's not present. Ms. Conrad could not be with us tonight, but we still want to honor her memory and her, her gifts of her husband in order that um, we have such a great school. So we do thank her for that. At this time, I want to recognize some of the honors. If you look in your program, you see names of our students with a little dollar sign. Those are names of students who have received scholarships. Of all the Conrad seniors, 88% of our students are receiving some type of scholarship to go on to college, and we are very proud of them. All of our students are exceptional, but we have a few that have really, really gone the second mile Many of them are wearing the National Honor Society stole, the collar. And I would like those children to stand, please. My National Honor Society students. Let's give them a big hand. <laughs> then many students are wearing all kinds of different uh, cords. Those cords are for receiving academy requirements or they have shown personal growth in the community involvement. 
Many of our students belong to one of the five academies that are at Conrad. It, either it's the Instructional Technology or the Health and Science or the Engineering Academy. Some of our students were in uh, the programs that gave blood donation for the blood drive, and they're wearing a red um, stole at this time. So you see many of our students have done over and above the call of duty. I also want to recognize two of our students as the first Gates Millennium Scholars of Conrad High School, Chiva Archaya and, oops, okay, Jamunda Kadaria. Would y'all please stand up? These students have received a full ride to the, to the college of their choice, and they can go as long as they want to go and achieve any degree they want to achieve. So we're very proud of that. I am also proud of our top 10%. You know, it takes a lot of hard work to become that group that is called the top 10% of the graduating class. We have a total of 217 students graduating, and to make that percentage takes a lot of perseverance and work. So I'd like our top 10 students to please stand. Thank you, students. Many of those same students are wearing the red cords because they donated blood, they did community service, they're in an engineering or another academy here at Conrad. They've done over and above the call of duty. Now I would like to introduce our salutatorian, is that right? Or no, I'm sorry, our valedictorian. No, our sal, our sal, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm making a mistake here, okay. Carla, if you'll come up, this is our number two student. Yes, this is your speech. You can do it any way you want. Chargers, four years ago, as we journeyed into our high school years, we came in unaware, anxious, and knowing four years later we would graduate. Since that time, friendships were built, knowledge was gained, life experience was attained. The one defining factor in my life has been my parents. They have been exemplary, installing the values needed to become successful. Dicen que los mejores, los primeros padres, no, los primeros maestros son los padres, means the first teachers are your parents. It is an achieving goal for any parent to witness their child graduate from an institution of higher learning. Thank you to my parents, a todos los padres, in being so supportive throughout this journey. Staff, and who can forget all the teachers and counselors, from elementary school to middle school and to Emmett J. Conrad High School. Thank you for the support, friendship, and most important knowledge. We are the class of 2013. We will move forth and embark into a new uncharted journey. Within this class, there are doctors, engineers, and lawyers, and maybe even a teacher. My fellow classmates, the future is yours. Be brave, be bold, and be daring in your choices and goals. Nothing is impossible. Everything is within your reach. Nunca te duermas sin un sueño, ni te levantes sin un motivo. This means never sleep without a dream or wake without a motive. Vamos adelante. Let's go forward, Chargers, class of 2013. That was our number two student, our salutatorian. Now, our number one student, our valedictorian address is by Ibrahim Mipana. 
Mi Paina. I would like to congratulate each and every one of you for braving through four years of high school and moving on to the real world. It's not going to be pretty. It's not going to be easy, but it's the real world. I'm not going to stand here and bore you with a long-winded speech about the importance of education because it has already been pounded and grounded into your brains. I am, however, going to talk about it in a more subjective approach. The education system is highly revered by society. The majority of people think it's the only way to become somebody, the only way to be successful. That's not entirely true. What you need most to succeed is aspiration. Aspiration, at its best, is what makes you who you are. You have to believe in yourself and those who believe in you. Not everyone has the same path in life. For some, that path is easy. For most, it isn't. Do not despair. If your life is filled with suffering, pain and agony will only make you stronger. Whatever your path is, however bad or good it is, are you going to make the most of it? Can you accomplish your dreams? Can you accomplish the dreams your parents imagined for you? Can you be the person you truly want to be? I was born in a very poor country. However, my parents sacrificed a major part of their livelihood and brought not only me, but my brothers and sisters here, which is why I stand before you today, which is why they are here today. Seven years we spent adapting to this newfound culture. Seven years we struggled, but we're still here and better than ever. So why am I telling you this? In the real world, you'll be faced with hardships. When you dive into that harsh reality, When you dive into that harsh reality that we're about to face, just remember that you're not alone and never give up on what matters the most, and that is you. Yes, it is scary, but life is the most valuable object. Live it, love it, but do not throw it away, no matter what happens. So long as you believe in yourself and have fun with it, life turns into a thing of beauty. You struggled for four years, but now you're here, moving on. I would like to congratulate each, one, each and every one of you again, and warm congratulations to Dr. Hackamack, who helped us get through four years of high school. Please join me in an applause. Dan Mitch Kay is a partner at the law firm of Atkin, Gump, Strauss, Hauer, and Feld. He has been recognized by D Magazine as one of the best lawyers in Dallas, Texas, monthly as a super lawyer, and as one of the best lawyers in America. He has lived in Dallas since 1981, and has been a resident of Dallas ISD, District 3, for more than 17 years. Mr. Mitch Kay received his BA with the highest honors from Stony Brook University, where he was a member of Phi Beta Kappa fraternity. He received his JD from the University of Chicago Law School. He serves on the board of directors of Texas Community Building Through Eternity Resources, a pro bono organization, and as vice chair of the board of directors of the Center of Vision Laws of the American Foundation for the Blind. He previously served on the School Finance Task Force of the Greater Dallas Chamber. He also served on the board of directors of the State Bar of Texas from 2008 until 2011. Mr. Mitch Case started and chaired his firm's school partnership program with James W. Fanning Elementary School in Dallas from 2005 until 2012. The program won the State Board of Education's Goat Level Award for Community Partnership in 2011. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you Mr. Dan Mitch Case. Well, thank you very much for that kind introduction. And thank you, Dr. Hackamack. Your work on behalf of our students and this school will long be remembered and appreciated. Good evening, graduates, and congratulations on the accomplishments that we are celebrating today. Your families, 
your teachers and friends and all of us here are all very proud of you. As a member of the school board, it's a high honor for me to be able to say a few words to you, the Emma J. Conrad class of 2013, as you move on to another exciting phase of your life. As graduates, you're embarking on a new journey, and you'll have more opportunities, face more challenges, and make many hard decisions. You have the ability to determine your own destiny. My advice to you is to follow your dreams and reach for the stars, and most importantly, never give up on yourself. Whatever, you, whatever your dreams are, you must understand that you're, you're not likely to reach them easily or quickly. Along the way, you'll have many disappointments and setbacks. Almost every successful person, everyone who has achieved their dreams, has had to overcome set, setbacks before they succeeded. Uh, Vince Lombardi, the great football coach, said it this way, it's not whether you get knocked down, it's whether you get back up. And two of the most successful coaches in Dallas Cowboys history, Tom Landry and Jimmy Johnson, both finished dead last in their first year in the NFL. Yet they persevered, they did not give up their dreams, and each of them went on to win two Super Bowl championships. Cite another example from the world of sports. Every, major, every year, Major League Baseball honors its pitcher of the year with an award named after Cy Young. Cy Young has the most wins in the history of Major League Baseball, and he also has the most losses. And Abraham Lincoln, of course, is one of our greatest presidents, but before he was elected president, he ran for the state legislature and lost. He ran for Congress and lost. He ran for the Senate twice and lost both times. He, he sought the vice presidential nomination of his party and lost, but he never gave up. And when he was elected in 1861, he never gave up his dream of keeping the nation together even as there was a lo losses after losses on the battlefields of the Civil War. A long time ago, Mark Twain said to a young friend, 20 years from now, you'll be disappointed by the things that you didn't try because you were afraid to fail. Wayne Gretzky, the great hockey player, hockey's all-time leading scorer, made the same point this way, you miss all the shots that you don't take. So go out there and follow your dreams. Don't be afraid to fail. And when you stumble and fall, get back up again. Before I, like, before I close, I'd like to offer one other suggestion. Looking back, I wish I had done this when I graduated many years ago. Although you've seen many of your teachers every day for the past four years, chances are pretty high that you'll never see some of them again after today. So I would suggest you take a minute to seek out and thank someone special who helped you get here today. You'll always be glad that you made that effort. In closing, let me say again, Congratulations to you, the Emma J. Conrad class of 2013. Go Chargers, I wish you every success in life. Thank you, Trustee Mitch Kay, and thank you for your support. If everyone will please be seated and have, we have your attention, please. We will continue. As principal of Emmett J. Conrad High School, I hereby affirm that each candidate has met all requirements for graduation as determined by the state of Texas and the Dallas Independent School District, they are qualified to receive their diplomas, or they are otherwise qualified to participate in this graduation ceremony consistent of the laws of the State of Texas and the Dallas Independent School District. With us today is Dr. James Terry, Interim Chief Financial Officer with the Administration's Confirmation.
On behalf of the uh, Dallas ISD administration and with the uh, superintendent's best wishes, I hereby confirm these graduates. Conrad High School, congratulations all of you. I am pleased to award these diplomas, certifying that they are graduates of the Dallas Independent School District. All right, we will begin the procession. Ibrahim Piana, <laughs> Carla Gonzalez, <laughs> Justin Donnell Patton, <laughs> Jada Thomas, <laughs> Violeta Treviso. Teresa Valderas, Jaime Gomez, Levi Towe, Godwin Asyogbon, Shiva Acharya, Anali Morales Catalan. Kiera Michaela Robinson, Clarissa Luna Aceves, Daniel Fernandez, Jose Guadalupe Ruiz, Arturo Osorio. Cristal Rodriguez, Dali Diaz, Eric Monterrubio, Claudia Moreno, Esteban Alberto Rodriguez. Tybricia Karis Wilson. Araceli Reyes. Claudia Itzel Calderon Ramirez. Ganga Ahikari. Mirna Aguilar. Mirta Aguilar. Brenda Aguillon, Ashley Alba, Maria Guadalupe Alcalá Bautista, Luis Amado, Tomás Miguel Andrade, Marisa Antunes Catalán, Carlos Alfredo Arredondo. Jose Antonio Arredondo. Jolisset Bamanga. Mayena Banini. Marlene Yared Berber. Tulasa Bandari, <laughs> Bim Batarai, Eden Bihoni, Bola 
Bolanos. Fernando Bolanos. December Danielle Bolden. Angela Brown. Jasmine Lakia Brown. Triana Donise Brown. Yennefer Brano. Veronica Carvajal. Daniel Carrion. Shonda Carruthers. Cruz Catalan Tapia. Bima Chapagai. Angel Rodriguez Chavez. Ayana Shiri Cobb. Regine Deanne Collier. Carlos Contreras. Leticia Contreras. Devante Marcel Cox. Darian, Darian D. Crawford. Harmonica Michelle Critton. Hey, hey, hey. Jesenia Cruz Aguilar. I'm so Estefania Delgado. Another beautiful girl. Congratulations. Alexis Dennis. Congratulations, sweetheart. Kumari Dango. Olivia Diaz. Oh. Elliot Bradley Disler. Lacola Dixon. I'm so proud of you. you know that? Ivan Doso. Sang Chin Eng. Shaka Devante English. Itzel Escobar. Kiara Escobar. Jacob Esparza. Cassidy Brielle Evans. Johnny Faustino. Vanessa Freire. Claudia Gallardo. Carlos Garcia. Evelio Garcia. Felicia Marisa Garcia. Francisco Garcia. Marvin Garcia. Nayel Garcia Diaz. Ruby Garcia. Prince G. Gay. Griselda Odelis Giron Cuellar. Isaac Glenn Jr. Beatriz Gonzalez. Miriam Guzman.
Bertram Harris. Blanca Hernandez. Gerardo Hernandez. Miguel Angel Hernandez. Tun Tun. Dequayden Ann Irving. Jose Guadalupe Jaramillo. Giovanna Lucila Jimenez. Antonio DeAndre Johnson. Isaiah Johnson. Jeremiah Johnson. Kaylin Johnson. Jamuna Kaderia. Rasima Carrick. Shakar Karki. Victoria Nicole Kelly. Diana Beatriz Lasso. Carabel Lima. My Diana. Asia Levi. Ramon Jimenez. Devante D. King. Raymond, congratulations. Alejandro Lopez. Mirna Lopez. Perla Karen Lopez. Adan Lucio. Miguel Arturo Lozano. Luis Alberto Mancilla Arredondo. Elmer Martinez. Jose Eduardo Martinez. Giovanni Martinez. Oscar Martinez. Ramon Morales. Danny Morales. Sasha Mohammed. Matthew Miranda. James E. Middleton. Sergio Mendoza. Oscar Cruz Mendoza. Jocelyn Mendez. Suit Malaki. Yesenia Medina. Nigel Demiron Mayfield. Kadarian Devon McAllister. Arian Natayeli Mascorro. Melissa Matthews. Jalen Morris. Lindia Faye Morrow. Guana. Oh, 
Francisco Noverón. Rachel Shimirimana. Florence Nakirutimana. Sikorian Offert. Carla Ontiveros. Davy M. Padilla. Maria S. Padilla. Elpidio Perez. Jose Perez. Kayla Ann Rhodes. Sue Ray. Alexis Reed. Shanice Redwine. Roberto Martin Ramos. You know, I never thought this girl would make Juan it. Ramos. Yeah. Eder Alexis Gonzalez Ramirez. Congratulations, honey. Cecilia Joni Prado. Wow, you look, you look really good. Congratulations. Tapash Pudel. Surya Pudel. Jairo Piña. Shakivia Brene Morgan. Veronica Elizabeth Moreno. Alejandra Guadalupe Moreno. Nakasha Nikeel Perez. Teja Dayan Perry. Sherry Rodriguez. Jocelyn Rodriguez Garcia. Viridiana Romero. Celine Jeanette Rosas. Luz Ruiz. Noemi Saavedra. Daisy Aurelia Salazar. Milton Salomon. Angeles Sanchez. Ruben Antonio Sandoval. Lady Bethsaida Santiago. Abu John Santo. Jessica Silva. Terence Sims. Courtney Slack. Erica Smith. Ladavia Smith. Xavier Soto. Fasu Sumahoro. Glenn 
Arthur Steele. Bupa Woti Subedi. Samuel Tatum, Jr. Not Nael Tekle. I know you made it. Lelandria G. Robinson. Asia Janice Roberson. Herbert Rivers. Janet Santos. Jantia Savage. Desiree Unique Thomas. Morris Toe. Ashley Yael Tolentino. Crystal Celeste Torres. Dequasia DJ Tryon. Fausto Valencia Jr. Maribel Vasquez. Honoria Sagrario Vega. Floricen Villarreal. Carlos Villegas. Derek Jamal Wade. Kayla Walker. Terrence Washington. Jordan Watson. Veronica Watson. Bonnie Dean Watts. Darnisha D. Wilkerson. Kiana Monique Williams. La Kendrick James Wilson. Jasmine Lacola Winston. Deshaun Wright. Dion Wright. Alberto Sierra. Chad Riley Scott. Stevon Sipion. Could we please, could we please 
get quiet for the school song. Parents, guests, honored guests on the stage, grandparents, friends, family, have you ever seen such a beautiful sight? I want to say this before our, I confirm our seniors. I want them to remember that they are a masterpiece, that they are beautiful, that they are made in the image of God. They are loved by their teachers, by the staff members, and by me at Conrad High School. Jeremiah 29, 11 says, I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. So with that to think about, I affirm right now that you are graduates. Please move your tassel from the right to the left. Congratulations, class of 2013.